Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning. It is Tuesday, Tuesday, Tuesday. And we're going to call today Reset. And that was the message of the day that my pastor gave on Sunday. And I, I am very, very much tuning into the reset because there's a lot of stuff going on and a lot of things are shifting and it, it's it, it feels like it does feel like a bunch of arrows are being thrown at you sometimes so it feels like you're constantly being attacked um when things get good uh a lot of bad things start to happen. Y'all ever realize that? Um, one way the enemy knows how to get to me is my father. Um, and my father is in the hospital right now. So, you know, it, it, it's, it's throwing a wrench in my mind. And then when you think about, uh, I should have got over the way. But when you think about uh, the, the, the group that we started, you know, slowly but surely the enemy wanted to pick us apart. And, and he started winning on that. We, uh, we missed our uh, passport appointment. Man, like so much that we all had going on at the same time, it was like, okay, well, I'm going to pick at this, and I'm going to pick at that, and we're going to test to see who's really committed, and we're going to see if you really have faith, and we're going to see if you guys keep going, and like, slowly but surely, we realized like, he been kicking our butt. Making things, like, really complicated. But that's why I thank my pastor and, and my sisters that God has blessed me with to really get the, 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 the words that I need. Like, first, I had to talk with my um, apartment complex because my dryer wasn't working. And my light is going out in the dining room. And they still haven't fixed the doorknob. And then everything with my daughter's hair, you know, her head started itching so bad. It was like, oh, my God, one thing after another after another welfare case getting canceled out. Just like, boom, 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 boom. It feels like I'm just getting bombed on. But you know what? God is saying, reset that thing. Reset it. And ever since we hit that reset button, I'm getting out of everything. I'm, I'm, I'm making a headway in every kind of way possible. And I thank you, Lord, for that. I thank you for Germanese calling me this morning. And I thank you for Lakeisha calling me this morning and really just providing that word that I truly need. Because I'm not going to let the enemy win at all, period. I refuse to let the enemy win at all. So, y'all, if you're being attacked right now, just listen and listen well. They're trying to, the enemy is trying to kill, steal, and destroy your joy, your business, your relationship, your family, your children. That's what he does. So if you feel like you're being attacked in every kind of way, pay attention and start cutting some things out. Start letting some of them old, useless, old, so-called friends go. They'll be back. They'll always be around. And some of them may not never come back around. But at the end of the day, it's a shift that is happening and it's necessary haven't you even realized that some of the people that were in your life last year aren't in your life this year 
some of y'all ain't in the job that y'all were in last year. Some of y'all ain't even in the same relationship that y'all was in last year. It's a shift and it's a reset. And at first I didn't understand what was going on. Like I thought I was on point with things and then all this stuff started happening. And all these attacks started happening. Why? Because the enemy said, I'm going to destroy your joy. I'm going to kill your plan. And I'm going to steal everything that you've been working for and watch you just fall apart. Well, I ain't fell apart yet. I got a little, got a little snappy and stuff a little bit. And, 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 and I, I, I've had my mind moments of crying and stuff like that. But that is a form of releasing. So I could release in that kind of way. Because God is listening to everything the same way that the enemy's listening, God is listening. Do you hear me? So reset that thing. Before I let y'all go today, we are going to armor up. You know how I like to do, especially with all the attacks going on right now. Father God, in the name of Jesus, I just thank you. I thank you for everything. I thank you for resetting everything in my life. I thank you for taking people out of my life that don't need to be around. I thank you for the abundance that you are providing. I thank you for every bit of peace that you provide. I thank you for all the shifting that you are doing among and in and within our lives. I ask that you touch on my children as they go throughout this summer camp. Man, protect them from their head down to the soles of their feet because even the enemy is trying to attack at them. So I rebuke all the attacks of the enemy. I rebuke the attacks of the enemy on candid conversations because it don't matter what you try to do. You're not going to stop us. We're going to keep on moving forward. I rebuke any attacks on our family members, on our church family members, on our family members in Arizona. Hi, Pastor Dennis. I rebuke any attacks of the enemy that he is doing amongst us right now. Because you have no power or authority in our lives. You may cause confusion. You may cause distraction. But it's only necessary for us to get where we need to be. Because God is doing a lot within you and within me. Father God, I ask that you cover Star CDC and Life Change Ministries. Cover the outreach centers. Cover everybody. Because we are all under attack in the mighty name of Jesus. I rebuke any kind of sicknesses that may try to come forth. I rebuke any kind of ills that try to come forth. I ask that you touch on my father right now. Right now. Whatever he is dealing with, touch on him in the mighty name of Jesus. Because you are our Jehovah Rapha. You are our the almighty builder. And through your blood we are cleansed. Through your blood we are revived. Through your blood we live. Through your blood. I thank you, Father, for any and all things. Salah, hallelujah, amen. Hit that reset button, y'all. Hit it. It's all right. It's okay to let some things go. It's okay to let some people go. There's going to be a lot of angry folks out there. My pastor said it, and you know what? There is. There's going to be a lot of hating folks. There's going to be a lot of darts thrown. But it's time to hit that reset. All right, y'all. I love you. If no one's told you they love you today, I have. I will talk to you guys later.